Is it okay to run a PC without a CMOS battery? If you're wondering whether your PC can run without a CMOS battery, you're not alone. This tiny battery plays a crucial role in your computer's operation, but what happens if it's missing or dead? First, let's understand what the CMOS battery does. It powers the complementary metal oxide semiconductor, CMOS, chip on your motherboard. This chip stores important settings like the date, time, and your computer's hardware configuration. The CMOS battery ensures these settings are retained even when your computer is turned off. Now, can a PC run without this battery? The answer is yes, but with some caveats. If the CMOS battery is dead or removed, your computer will still boot up, but it will lose all the stored settings. This means you'll have to set the date and time every time you start your PC, and other custom BIOS settings will revert to their default values. For some computers, especially those with a simple setup like a single hard drive and no dedicated GPU, running without a CMOS battery might not cause significant issues. However, if you have multiple hard drives or a dedicated graphics card, you might encounter problems. For instance, the BIOS might default to using the onboard GPU instead of the dedicated one, or it might have trouble recognizing all the hard drives correctly. In some cases, a dead or missing CMOS battery can lead to more serious issues, such as boot problems or checksum errors. Your computer might fail to pass the power on self-test, post, or get stuck in a boot loop. You might also see error messages related to CMOS or BIOS settings during StartHub. To give you a clearer picture, if you remove the CMOS battery, you'll need to reconfigure your BIOS settings every time you start your PC. This can lead to longer boot times because the BIOS has to set everything up from scratch each time. So, while it is possible to run a PC without a CMOS battery, it's not the most convenient or efficient way to operate your computer. If you find yourself in a situation where the CMOS battery is dead or missing, Replacing it with a new one, typically a CR2032 lithium coin cell battery, is the best solution to avoid these issues. In summary, while a PC can technically run without a CMOS battery, it's not recommended due to the potential for various operational issues and the need to constantly reconfigure settings. Keeping a functioning CMOS battery ensures smoother and more efficient operation of your computer.